That's why we're out here. That's why it's so important that you understand what Kyrie and Kanye are using, losing millions and billions for. Bring it out. To, bring, to bring it out to you. That you are the real Jews. That's, right. That's what they're losing the money for. And they're losing these endorsements. They're losing this stuff. And what are our people doing? They're listening to the media, listening to Shaq and Charles Barkley and all these other coons that want to sit there and talk about, oh, no, these are idiots. No, they're not idiots. They actually can see the oppression of their people. Right. And they're wise enough to see it and be mad about it and be like, no, I'm going to go into my history and I'm going to find out who I really am. We have to understand, there's more coming after this life. This ain't all it is. But our people think, you only live once, this is it. That's the end, and then what's death? Oh, I black out, it's over. And now I'm in heaven. Nah, man, hell no. Read that. Second Ezra, chapter nine, verse 12. Huh? The same must know it at the death before, by before, pain. Before, before, uh, give me verse 11. Second Ezra. Chapter 9, verse 11. Read that. And they that have loathed my law. And they that have loathed my law. Here we are. We're bringing out God's law to our people. And guess what our people do? When he said, when the Bible says loathe, it's another word for hate. They hate God's laws. Jeez, and because they hate God's laws, what does that mean? You hate God. Right. You hate God and you hate his people. Read it again. And they that have loathed my law. Because the law was only given to you so-called blacks and Hispanics. That's why we're out here. That's why it's so important that you understand what Kyrie and Kanye are using, losing millions and billions for. Bring it out. To, bring, to bring it out to you. That you are the real Jews. That's, right. That's what they're losing the money for. And they're losing these endorsements. They're losing this stuff. And what are people doing? They're listening to the media, listening to Shaq and Charles Barkley and all these other coons that want to sit there and talk about, oh, no, these are idiots. You know, the game that we used to love and we promote, it brings people together. And it hurts me sometimes when we have to sit up here to talk about stuff that divides the game. Now, now we got to answer for what this idiot has done. No, they're not idiots. They actually can see the oppression of their people. Right. And they're wise enough to see it and be mad about it and be like, no, I'm going to go into my history and I'm going to find out who I really am. Right. Because the right. white man in slavery didn't tell me who I was. Right. I'm not black. What, are, what is that? I'm not none of these things. So guess what? We have to know that we are the Israelites so that we know that these commandments, bring, they apply only to us. That's right. We must understand that so now we know how to conduct ourselves. Read it again. And they that have loathed my law. So they that loathe my law, the law that was only given to you so-called blacks and Hispanics, that's why you're getting punished right now. Right. That's why you're trying to smoke your stress away right now. That's right. That's why you're trying to do, go at, at the bottom of the bottle to try and get away from these curses. Bring it because up. Because you don't understand. You have commandments you are required to keep. And that's the, you because you have not been taught that, you have no direction. So now when we come out here and give you the direction, you hate us. Read. Well, they had yet liberty. Uh -huh. and what, so while they had yet liberty, right now your heart is beating. Meaning you can hear these words. You have liberty right now. You're walking around. You have a chance to do what? Repent. Come back to your God. That's what we're out here to show you. Read. Well, they had yet liberty. Uh-huh. And when as yet place of repentance was open unto them. And when as yet place of repentance, what you so-called Christians call grace. That's right. That's what it is. Space to repent, to come back. 
That's what repent means. You're returning back to your God, right. your nationality, your culture, your heritage. None of us, none of our forefathers believed in Christmas. We didn't know about that. That's a new thing on the, well, it's not a new thing on the earth, but it's a new thing on the earth in terms of our God, because it comes after our God. And our God did not approve of our people to be worshiping that garbage. Right. Understand that. Read it again. And when as yet place of repentance was open unto them. Place of repentance is open unto all of you, my brothers and sisters, who can hear our voice. You have a chance to come back to your God. Come back to your heritage. Stop breaking the Sabbath. The seventh day Sabbath was made for you. That's right. Today is the Sabbath of the Lord. Right. Come back and repent to your God. Right. Your God is not white, he's black. That's, That's right. right. Read. Understood not, but despised it. But they did what? Understood not, but despised it. When, 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 read from the wild, while they had yet. Read that again. Hey. When it's yet place of repentance was open unto them. So place of repentance is open unto all of our Israelite brothers and sisters who are still alive, who God did not put to death yet. So guess what? What should they be doing? They should be here when they hear God's word. That's right. They should be coming over here and listening and being sorrowful. Because why? What happened? We were finding out, yo, we're not keeping these laws at all. We thought we were keeping, we thought we were keeping the feast of dedication. Uh, the Passover, the, 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 the Feast of uh, Pentecost. Right. We thought we were keeping these things. The Day of Atonement, guess what? All of these are what we were supposed to be doing. That's but right. what are we doing instead? That garbage. Right. It's Christmas, Thanksgiving, yesterday, or uh, well, Thursday, whatever it was. The point is, we're celebrating white man foolishness. That's right. white, white supremacy. That's what we're that's what we're celebrating. That's what our people are celebrating. Guess what? The Bible is against all of that. Right. God hates all of those holidays. Right. Understand? Give me Amos 5. We'll come back to that. Amos 5. Bring it out. Amos 5 and uh it should be around 20, 20, 21. 21. Read that. Amos 5, because God did not agree with any of your Thanksgivings uh this past Thursday. You prayed to a God, you did pray to a God. The God that's called the so-called white man. That's right. Your Caucasian white Jesus. That's who you are all pray to for Thanksgiving. That's who gave y'all your blessings. That's who it was. The God of the Bible has no idea about your Thanksgiving. He has nothing to do with that. That's right. Read. Amos chapter 5 verse 21. Watch what the God of the Bible says. Read. I, I hate I despise your feast days. I hate and despise your feast days because Thanksgiving is not God's feast day at all. Right. He didn't give us that. You shouldn't have been eating that none of that food because that food, that, that, that turkey, the cranberry sauce, the, all of those things, they represent your demise. That's, right. That's exactly what they were made for. The turkey was the body of the Native American Indians that they cut up. That's why they cut it up. The cranberry sauce is supposed to be the blood. Bring it up. Why, what are y'all celebrating? Understand that. That's why we're telling you the God of the Bible does not agree with the holidays that y'all keeping. That's right. These garbage traditions. Because you're sitting there and you're celebrating genocide. Right. Your own genocide. Bring it out. You think God likes to see his children be slaughtered and then sit there and celebrate foolishness that they were given by the oppressor? Jesus. Read. And I will not smile when you are selling assembly. God did not have, he did not crack a smile. He didn't smirk. He didn't do nothing with your Thursday offering that y'all gave. This past Thanksgiving. The thanks, the thanks you gave went on deaf ears because your white Jesus that you celebrated this past Thursday, he doesn't exist. None of your gods exist, but the God of Israel. That's right. Understand that. Bring it out. Read it again. Hey, he has despised your feast day. The, the black God, he despised that feast day, all of your feast days. All of those traditions, your Christmases, 
They're all trash. Read. And I will not smile at your solemn assembly. And he would not smile at our solemn assemblies. Understand that. That's why we're coming out here and letting you know all of those days of wicked should not be celebrated. And then we tell you, we're not telling you, oh, don't do, don't do, and don't do this. But then don't show you what to do instead. We show you the answer. God shows you the answer. Understand that. Back to 2nd Ezra. 2nd Ezra, chapter 9, verse 11. Read. And they that have loathed my law. And, and you, every one of you that are hearing that Thanksgiving is wrong, celebrating Christmas is wrong, celebrating New Year's is wrong, right. celebrating all of these stupid uh, uh, holidays, your July 4th, your Valentine's Day, your all of those are garbage and right. lies. Bring it up. But guess what? As we're showing you that you can repent from these things, what's happening? Read. But they had yet liberty. And when as yet place of repentance was open unto them. Read on. Understood not, but despised it. You understood not, but instead, what did they do? They hated it. They despised it. Understand that. We can't have that. They, they, that we can't be doing that. We have to understand this is our heritage that we are bringing out to our people. You, you, every time you see the purple and gold, you should understand, hey, these, these purple and gold brothers are coming out and they're going to restore to us our nationality, our real heritage. Right. That's what we're out here to do. That's all we're doing. Right. We're out here to show you real love. Yes. The love that you haven't gotten from your pastor, right. from your educators. Right. None of them can show you love. Right. They don't know what love is. Right. Read on. The same must know it at the death by pain. But guess what's going to happen to those who hate God's commandments the on same, the streets right now? The same must know it at the death by pain. The same will know it after death. Y'all right. don't think about after death. Y'all think it's over, it's just, oh, okay, I die and that's it. I black out. Nah. Nah, man. Understand that. You loathe one right now while you have a chance at salvation. This is your time. Bring it out. Understand that. This is not the time to be sitting there and looking at your brothers and hating your own brothers. Read. Verse 13. Uh -huh. And therefore, be thou not curious of the ungodly self uh, Drop that, drop that. Back to uh, Amos 5. No, give me Jeremiah 30. Jeremiah 30 and 15. Jeremiah 30 and 15. Let's actually see when is it that our people are supposed to be carrying these traditions, these things. We're not carrying those traditions, but let's hear about real Thanksgiving. Let's hear about being really married. When, when, when do blacks and Hispanics, when can we actually feel those feelings, feel those sentiments? Read that. Up, Jeremiah chapter 30, verse 15. Read. Get out. Why quest thou for thine affliction? So the first thing we must understand, God has the Israelites, the real Jews, in affliction. That's right. right. You are in affliction. You've been crying. The, uh, the officer read it to us earlier. In the scripture, it tells you the real Jews are in poverty and tribulation. Right. Bring it out. So read that again. Why quest thou? For thine affliction. So God is asking us a question. Why are you why are you crying for your tribulation? Why are you crying? Why are you blacks and Hispanics crying about your affliction? Why? Why are you doing that? Why are you to why are you going out there to the white man talking about Black Lives Matter? Why? Read. The sorrow is incurable. Your sorrow is incurable. Ain't no nation or no man on the face is gonna fix that. Right. At all. But who is? Well, let's read on and find out. Read. The sorrow is incurable uh -huh. for the multitude of thy iniquity. Wait, wait, that sorrow is incurable. Why? For the multitude of thy iniquity. You hear that? Your sin is the reason your conditions. Your sin is the reason that you are in the conditions that you're in. Right. Understand that. Cursed in the city. Cursed in the field. Last hire. First fire. Broken families. All kinds of crazy conditions our people are in. High blood pressure, diabetes, right. gout. We lead in all of these categories. Sexual transmitted diseases, murder rate, incarceration rate. How are we leading in all those conditions? And y'all think it's still good? Bring it out. How y'all not tired of this? Right. Come on. 
Come on, man, read. Because thy sins were increased. Because thy sins were increased. This is the reason for all of these plagues that we suffer today. Right. That's what we're showing y'all. The answers are here. We'll read on. And I have done these things. Well, oh, 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 no, no, wait, no, no. Satan did these things. I have done these things. God is telling you, I did these things. That's yes, right. So when he said your, your soul is incurable, when you're over here thinking that you're going to go to the white man to sit there and look for justice for, oh, Trayvon Martin, um, who else? Uh, freaking Tamir Rice, Rice uh, Philando Castile, oh, Freddie Gray. Freddie Gray, on and on. Guess what? What is God telling you? I, I have done these things. God did these things. Right. Oh. Unto What is the nation? Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation is children with role models. Nation is unity. Nation is